Danny Staten on the Daddy Dan Blog main channel. Well, the Daddy Dan Blog only channel. My other channel's called Danny's World now. And I'm headed for Crescent Hill. In the woods behind the old Sky City store in Pelzer, South Carolina. The old trails. You could walk this trail I'm on right here all the way to one road crossing to the river. And they reported back in the day that creatures would come up this trail into the back of the store area and steal the food from the dumpsters that they were throwing away. I thought I would give it a quick look since while I was out filming earlier in the back of the store, giving y'all a little look at that area, talking about that very incident. I heard two whoopee sounds come from Crescent Hill, which is the name of this area that I'm in right now. At least that's what the locals called it back when I was young. This deep, dark, danky road through the woods. I was thinking homeless people had lived in this area for a while. As you can see, the remains of an old, what the fuck ever that was. Uh, I did hear some whoopee sounds. Could have been an owl, maybe. Maybe a Bigfoot. Look how dank these woods are with their cane poles and overlays. When I was young, there wasn't one single cane grew here. It was just light forest and you could walk right through it. You can almost see as far back as I am now. But now it's all grown up. It's dark in here. Dark and shady. And I know that homeless people have slept in here before. I've heard some of the homeless people tell me tales of grunts and growls and strange things in the woods. My friend was named Charles Grady. He passed away a couple of years ago. My friend Charles told me an interesting tale about what happened to him right down here where I'm going on top of Crescent Hill. Hmm. Was there something over there moving? Like a little polecat maybe, a skunk. Look, somebody left a bed out here. That just shows that people sleep here. I have. I'm almost to Crescent Hill now. That's maybe the extent of my travels in through here today. <laughs> Hadn't planned on doing no hiking much. Not dressed for it, and I'm unarmed. So there you go. <clears throat> this is the place they call Crescent Hill. Right where I'm standing here today. Very near my sister's house in Pillsbury, South Carolina. From the top of the Crescent Hill, the old camp sat on the rocks over here. Where my friend Charlie Grady used to make his camp, pitch his fire, and hang out in the woods. He told me a story about his little encounter of seeing a giant, he said, 10 foot tall hairy man walking through the woods one night. It scared Charlie Grady so bad, he wouldn't ride this trail no more. He didn't spend no time in these woods no more. I'm way back up in here now. And I have seen nothing moving. Maybe on the video playback, you'll see something moving. But I'm going to give it a few more minutes and look around. The Crescent Hill area of Pelzer, South Carolina. Just to see if anything pops this little ugly evil head out at me. Because you can tell by this that something big has come through here and crushed the hell out of these trees. I get that a lot. You can see trail sign that something's been there, but you can't tell what's been on the damn trail. You know, this ain't no spooky place like Mertwood, but you just don't, you got damn spider webs everywhere though. You don't know what you're gonna run across when you're in the woods, and I really hate to be in here freaking unarmed. It'd be my luck to run across a bear or some wild dogs or something with bad attitudes. <clears throat> Our worst people. If you're wondering why I'm fighting around, it's all these goddamn spider webs. You can't walk through here. Did I Dan or would not? There it goes again. Close to town as we are, it could be somebody hammering, maybe? But that was a weird knocking sound just now. Off in that direction. 
It's a little bit angus deeper than he wanted to go already. But I'm giving, giving you a look inside Crescent Hill. When I come back and do another investigation in Crescent Hill in a month or two after the winter sets in and all these greens off the trees, we'll be able to see a lot better here. And I will be back, Crescent Hill. And the winter investigations I really like because I don't get hot and sweaty. And there's the way you go down Crescent Hill right there. I'm not going down it because I'll have to come the fuck back up it. And that's enough for me here. <coughs> I'm already about to die. I'm about to die from heat exhaustion from being in these damn hot ass woods. And it's 100 degrees out here. I hadn't been attacked by mosquitoes today, though. That's, a, that's just to spell the fuck on over, I guess. Mm. Anyway, this is Danny State on the Danny Dan Block. Deep in the woods of Crescent Hill in Pelster, South Carolina. Showing you where Charlie Grady once saw Bigfoot back in the 80s. His famous story he told every time he'd get drunk and sit around my campfires. I used to love to hear that boy tell that tale. Be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. And if I do see a hairy son of a bitch or anything going on, I will restart the camera. And be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. And this is Danny Staten saying, blog over.